And now to Borneo State, where Governor Babangana Zulum has visited survivors of Wednesday's twin bomb attacks receiving treatment at the State Specialist Hospital in Metagori. Governor Zulum assured of government support towards the recovery. It was the news senior reporter Jesse Tafida has details, and we'll return with business news. It's been two days since victims of the twin bomb attack are brought to the State Specialist Hospital, Maiduguri. Today, the state governor, Babagana Zulum, is here alongside top government officials to see how the victims are recovering. He spent some time interacting with each patient. The governor expressed sadness over the incident and assured of his support to take care of the victims. At so far, so good. Many of them have died. But the remaining ones are receiving treatment and many were discharged. I want to commend the ICRC for supporting them. I want to commend the management of this very important hospital, as well as the, as well as the staff of the Ministry for Health. They are doing very well, but there is need for us to provide additional support for them. The, the State Emergency Management Agency are also doing very well. The police and other officials in the state, especially the military and paramilitary, are doing very well. But we shall put heads together in order to you know, bring succor and relief to the people of Borno State. The governor disclosed that heightened security measures will be put in place to avert any security threats to lives and property. This is a worrisome phenomenon and we must do something. Are we, there is a need for us to review the utilization of you know, chemical fertilizers in Borno State. Hitato urea was banned for utilization in Borno State. But as the security situation improves, uh, we decided to use urea fertilizers. I cannot judge by now, but I think we shall discuss with the researcher with a view to determining the potentials of urea in making explosives. And government responsibility is to ensure the protection of lives and properties of the people. And then we have reviewed the coffee, inshallah, by tomorrow 6 a.m. People will be allowed to go about their normal businesses. But whoever decided to take the laws into his or her own hand shall be dealt accordingly. At the moment, most of the victims are being discharged, while few are responding to treatment. Jesse Tafida, TVC News, Maiduguri.